All right, it's some 38 minutes after 8 here on the AM show. It's a special AM show uh, because there's an historic visit uh, from uh, Otumfo Osei to the second. He is in Ochimai today, and we've received, uh, guys, uh, we have the program uh, lined up for today. So it's actually beginning, all I expected to be seated by 11 a.m., mm. and this is the climax of the month long. Uh, activities the 75th anniversary of uh, the death of Nanase Oferiata the first uh, so at 11 30 or uh, Osajifu would arrive at the Deba grounds and then at 12 Otunfo is expected to also arrive uh, and then 12 10 p.m. the presidents would arrive and then you know the whole program will begin. It will end at 2.30 per the program when Osajifu and Utunfo will depart after the president. Lots of things in between and we will bring you exactly what happens uh, here on Joy News. We've got our colleagues Elton is in Abuakwa. Erastos Asari Donko is in Abuakwa as well for this special uh, day. We've got many more colleagues uh, there including our technical crew and all. So we will bring you Details. Um, mm. She said you bring comprehensive. Yeah. <laughs> comprehensive, comprehensive. So we have Erastos Asari Donko. Yes, um, live. Erastos, good morning. This is your first major assignment after marriage. So congratulations to you again. mischief. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Erastos. Did you hear that? Yeah, I can hear you, Mama V. The line is very faint, but I think we can manage. Okay, so um, let me... Let me say it's slightly uh, sunny and slightly cloudy here uh, at Chebi. And where we are standing now is the Chebi uh, Palace. In fact, it's colorful uh, this morning and it has prepared itself. Indeed, it's pregnant with surprises uh, this morning for the visit of the Asante Hine of Pimsuo or Tikoposo Nana Osetu to the second. And in fact, the visit is historic indeed. And that is what everybody is anticipating. Uh, from the streets uh, where we came from, right from the entry of KB uh, uh, to this point, we are seeing lots of people clad in their traditional cloths, uh, either Kente or uh, an African print or uh, some black and white designs um, right here, anticipating that they will all be part of this whole uh, event. It is historic because despite the checkered history of the Achins and the Ashantis, um, the two leaders are coming together uh, to show unity and as we mark the 75th anniversary of Nana Oforiata, uh, who reigned up to 1943. So in front of the uh, at the moment, um, there is a bigger days to this side, uh, red carpet all along, and we do not know the designation yet, though we have some hints of who is going to sit where. But if you see very colorful arrangement, uh, we will have the police band seated right there. And then we have, we understand, uh, the Ochenhine, Nana uh, Amwetia for Ripenyi, uh, we'll be sitting on that days to that side. That is what we do understand, but um, it, it may change. We do not know. Then we have um, certain arrangements for other dignitaries also done in that particular manner. Then uh, to my back here, we'll be having uh, a sitting arrangement here. In fact, we are expecting the Asantehene, uh, Nana Osetutu, uh, the second coming in with 21 paramount chiefs per the list I have uh, with me now I can count 21 paramount chiefs out of the uh, 70 uh, paramounts we have in uh, Asante Mine if you count of course um, all the other uh, paramounts that are outside Ashanti region we get 70 but 21 of them I have received confirmation uh, they are uh, coming with Otunfo the uh, advanced team for the Asante Hene has arrived already, and I have seen uh, the linguist Nana Kantan uh, around, and so I'm assured that the advanced team is here already. We do understand that the Otunfo's uh, team will be setting off in some few minutes, and so by 11 o'clock, we are sure 
uh, that we will be starting proceedings right here. So the day is still pregnant uh, with lots of uh, pomp and pageantry, tradition at its best as we uh, mark the 75th anniversary of Nana Oforiata uh, here at Chebi Palace. Let me speak with some people here. In fact, they are quite expectant. Um, Nana, good morning. Morning. How are you today? Uh, well, uh, tell me, uh, how does this all mean to you as a citizen of Chebi and Anachim, for instance? Oh, yeah. Send the Wabisami there, Majidia, sir, Kakra, Mitimiaka, and as a Jumadia, I a Kosui, a Adia, a year, and Niswa Kasikasikas, a son, sir, and a year da Pona, a year or Chehi, or Chimaura, and a Santa Maura, a Babatu said, it's a year Nijasam Kasikasipa, na a year of free. Nana Ufure Ata the first. Ah, or no so Ou Yen Fisia do a so en numini. Na or no so ye kaino any fisia do a sunum. Na just say any just some kasia pa is answer a ye rano or be some ya papa. It's a ne a ye nija sem kasia pa. Well so all that he's saying is that they are very happy uh, because they are having a historic visit. It has never happened uh, in the history of Chebi where we are having your Tinghini and uh, the leader of the Ashanti Kingdom, and that is the Otiko Koswa, for two forces to uh, join in hands, coming over to Chebi is historic and it makes them uh, very happy. Um, when you have Fikakra, uh, um, have, you, have you seen anything like this before? Oh, David, me who sabe asa, Usha, if you said you are soon, I will hear you. I will see and na a year yura or chimera a year or saddle for I'm what you for the penny and then why ye be a my yen in a year baby who ye who be sadder say our chima near Santa Mai a bedding couple might say a day I saw any bar. Well, so he says he's never seen that in the history uh, of Chebi before of Otihine and Asantihine coming together. Uh, this is the first time uh, in his lifetime. Uh, let me find out from uh, Madame here what this means for the unity uh, between Ashantis and Achins. Um, Yo, me ya from in an ascent to Abu Ajua, a Pebahima. Near me, who is idea, a caution and idea, and Nijay, and my Ochemai, a Santi, and watching him, and down for fun, ye who be that. Nanny, a caution, and no, I hear for Bebre, a decayaba. Obi and Timia, and your Ankai, and no for Yata, and that. Or Sadio for Muetia, and no buyer, one who say, as I saw Okai, Nayadina. Now, dear, I'll sign you for your dear who be that. I'll sign you for why I have a papa. I shall chimney when you know I'm not or chimney, so they say, ye didn't acquire Well, so Nana Santua is the um, Apija Hima, uh, that's the Apija Queen of Kibi, and that's what he's saying that. Uh, many of the uh, chiefs have come around during their reign. Uh, they could not bring Ashanti and Achins together. And so if this time around they've been able to do it, uh, to bring uh, the occupant of the Golden Stool and the leader of the Achins together at one point, they think that a historic is something that has never happened before and they are really indeed happy. Uh, um, I think I'll go back to my earlier question. Um, oh, yeah, well, well, so uh, she's saying that uh, as far as she's concerned, there is no rivalry between Achims and Ashantis. It's just love which has uh, transcended through history, and that is what they are continuing. There is no hatred, there is nothing, only love, and they are happy uh, to continue with that tradition. And so um, let me say that um, 
when you go back into history, some of the Ashanti kings have married from Atim. Even the current occupant of the Golden Stool uh, is marrying from Atim. And so you see the uh, relationship between uh, the Atims and the Ashantis, very uh, uh, beautiful indeed. It goes way back into history, though uh, they fought many wars together. Um, this is the time that the two leaders are fought in a more closer uh, 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 collaboration to bring the peoples together for development as we mark the 75th anniversary of Nana Ofori Atta. And so we have many people trooping in at the moment, uh, chiefs from all walks of life. Uh, we have dignitaries from all manner of places. In fact, when you walk down from the street to this place, uh, you see all the vehicles lined up on the streets. There are other activities as well, but this is the main point, and that is where all the roads are leading to. And so, in just a matter of minutes, uh, we will be uh, seeing what will happen. The program will start, and um, we will all be uh, seeing tradition at its best, because when uh, Otufo is coming to the grounds, you see the regalia, the traditional regalia. You see uh, the, the, the beautiful tradition that will come here. The same applies to the Ochihini. Um, I don't know whether they will come in a palanquin, but on occasions like this, they do. And so that is what people are expecting. There are tourists who are also coming in here uh, to try to catch a glimpse of this beautiful occasion. And so multimedia, uh, we are also grounded right here. Uh, on all platforms, uh, we're bringing to you uh, the best of tradition today. Tari Donko, uh, Erastos, I, I said earlier, because you couldn't hear, that this is your first major assignment after your marriage. But I also realize you're using pregnant a lot. Uh, so I don't know if that's, you know, like you're notifying us of something. But thank you very much for now, Erastos Asari Donko. Uh, we will be seeing more of him, hearing more of his reports today because of this historic visit. Otum Force 8 to the second uh, visiting Ochimaing and uh, Ochihine uh, Amwetia Ofori Peying uh, in Abuakwa today. We will bring you live coverage of that uh, and various conversations on the ground today, guys. Well, that's, that's a good one. It also shows that um, at least as far as the traditional gates are concerned in our country for the Akan state, uh, somebody's thinking to make sure that we, we tend to paint a, a certain positive picture uh, mm. based on the perception that there's some animosity or not, even though yeah. sometimes uh, that is always disputed. I mean, I, I think, uh, yes, a, lot to, a, a little too much has been made of this is apparent rivalry between mm. the two mm. uh, tribes, but actually it, it, there, there is so little of that. Mm. And you could tell from what um, Erastos was told by those two uh, he interviewed that, well, honestly, I mean, look, the Asantehene has an Achim wife, you know, so, I mean, what are we, what are, what are we suggesting when mm. we try to paint this picture of rivalry? I think politics is what has rather yeah. Yeah. superimposed itself over uh, the reality of the traditional unity that they mm. actually have. Sure. And that is what we should celebrate, mm. you know, uh, mm. the unity yeah. of these two yeah. massive, massive tribes. And I, and I think that also uh, we can learn better uh, in the modern day, in the current dispensation, how to coexist as um, ethnic groups, mm. as tribes, as uh, regional people, etc. Because Ghana is diverse. And um, if you look at the social cultural influences of the day, vis-a-vis uh, -vis what happens in urban Ghana and, uh, and peri-urban and rural Ghana. Uh, things are changing. Mm. People's um, pop cultural traits are changing. Yeah. Their behavioral patterns are, tra are changing. So mm. perhaps maybe the media can be the forefront at mm. leading some of yeah. these um, perceptive mm. reformation mm. as we need. More talking points, but right now we have to bring you some show businesses brought to us. Ketsi, Awake purified water. Becky is here after this.